I was brought up in a quite a poor family. We lived in a, in a quite a poor estate in, in Huddersfield. Um, very good community of spirit, but lots of low achievement and low attainment. And education wasn't a priority. I didn't seem to have any control over where I was going or what I was doing. I didn't even actually have any type of dream. He became a forklift truck driver, um, amongst other things. I filled a crossword puzzle in. It was from uh, Mensa. A couple of weeks later, they got in touch and said, would you like to do a test because you've got some abilities in this area? And thought, right, I'm not going to turn around on the day of my retirement and go, what if? The Open University has a long history of working with students who just want to find out things really, they're not sure where it might take them. The one thing that struck me on the prospectus that I was looking at was health and social care because it was about life and I felt at that point that the only qualification I had was life, my experiences in life. He started on the health and social care degree so he began his studying at the age of 30 having not opened a book for 14 years. The moment we started talking about health and social care um, I was in there, it, there was a buzz, something was lit under me and I felt very, very quickly that this was where I belonged. I was driving my forklift truck until four in the morning and then I'd get the textbooks out for an hour and a half. I've seen so many people suffer, I wanted to be able to help, I wanted to do something. So I started doing voluntary work at a school for boys with emotional and behavioural difficulties and a, a vacancy came up and that was it for me, that was the start of moving away from um, using my um, hands to use in my brain. So the aims and objectives of today are learning. For me it's a journey, it's something that travels with me. Uh, it's not something that I do, it's something that I, I am. At the end of his last year he also started another degree which is where he started to study for his probation work. I just thought it was an area where um, there was so much difference that could be done to people's lives. While still being employed by the National Probation Service I applied to be a part-time associate lecturer with the Open University. John has worked on six undergraduate courses. I remember doing my first lecture and looking at the students and I wanted to empower with them. Um, the same as I've done when I was working with the boys. Believe in yourself, you're capable, you can do it. I've done it, now it's your turn. I'm still that person driving that forklift truck, except I guess I'm now driving life.